On October 9, 2023, transcripts were released for convicted child predator Keegan Klein. A redacted copy of an Indiana State Police report was included in the filing. Under the state's Exhibit 4A, created on December 13, 2021, a member of the Delphi Murder Investigation Task Force, Trooper Master Harshman, filed a report which was reviewed and signed off by Detective Jerry Holman, another member of the task force. The narrative for his report indicated that on December 6, 2021, ISP released a media request for information from anyone who had communicated with a fake online profile by the name of Anthony Schatz, and that account was created by Keegan Klein. As a result of that public appeal, a witness contacted the ISP tip line on December 8, 2021, in reference to her having communicated online with Keegan Klein. As a result, Delphi Murder Investigation member and U.S. Marshal Jeremy Clinton arranged for detectives to meet with her in Terre Haute. On December 9, 2021, Harshman and Clinton met with the victim, who was underage and 16 at the time of these interactions, and they interviewed her regarding various social accounts that she had communicated with Klein in 2018 and 2019. These social media platforms included, but were not limited to, Snapchat, Instagram, and Facebook Messenger. Further accounts in the names of Emily Ann and Trey Lauren were also used to communicate with the victim. Klein attempted to meet with the victim in real life at least 30 times. Communications with Klein ended in 2019 when the victim threatened to go to authorities about her involvement with Klein. On December 9, 2021, Detective Tony Liggett of the Carroll County, Indiana Sheriff's Department traveled to LaPorte, Indiana and retrieved the Samsung phone that the victim used to communicate with Keegan Klein. The victim's mother indicated she believed she had erased everything, but detectives processed the phone and attempted to determine if there was anything of evidentiary value on the device.